Hi, and welcome back to Point and Do, where we provide insight into the next generation of user interfaces. I'm Jonathan Brill. This week, Microsoft launched the Surface SDK, so today we're showing examples of what we call Point and Do, a great approach to creating intuitive, multi-touch applications that we came to while working with Microsoft on best practices for Surface. People organize objects in the real world by moving them around, stacking them, and then modifying them. Traditional point-and-click user interfaces ignore the richness of this experience. It's both easy and dangerous to transfer vestigial paradigms into multi-touch. Multi-touch is a different thing. The testing we've seen suggests that many so-called WIMP best practices slow users down, confuse them, and make multi-touch applications harder to learn. Mouse-based thinking just doesn't fit here. By contrast, when done well, Point and Do creates software that is easier to learn and use than traditional point and click interfaces. Applications feel intuitive when they combine Point and Do with Surface's multi touch interaction and object recognition technologies. This is because the interface seamlessly integrates content being used with how users want to manipulate it. The combination of Point and Do approach with technology results in a new class of applications that make it easier for groups of users to interact with complex information. Thanks for tuning in, and as always, please leave your comments.